So let's just be real. Well, this is already a foul. He's trying to regain the dribble, okay? He gets swarmed and tackled. Ball goes flying, okay? No whistle. Now let's check one more angle. Look at it again. Foul. Ooh, damn. Ref, notice. Brian's looking, ref's looking. No call, okay. Well, timeout. Okay, he hadn't even been tackled yet, but I'm just saying, the signal has begun. The bat signal had begun at this moment. And there's a knockdown. Ball goes flying. So, you know, you guys let me know what you think in the comments. I'm not saying it's a bad call, and I'm not saying it was a clean either. So, you guys tell me. But since this involved KD, you want to know what this reminded me of? Who remembers this Houston Rockets versus Golden State game? I think it was like 2019. Mind you, they were in OT. Game is tied. 30 seconds left. KD drives. Loses the handle. Then what does he do? Goes completely out of bounds to save the ball. It should have been Houston's ball at this point. But no. Look at that. One step out of bounds, two steps out of bounds, three steps out of bounds, touching the ground while touching the ball. You can't just stand out of bounds and push the ball back in bounds. This dude was damn near in the parking lot. And just look at Harden hitting the cabbie. Come on, Ruth. Who gets the ball next? Clay. What does he do? Dishes it to Curry. What does Curry do? Pump fake, dribble, dribble, pulls up, knock down the midi. And would you look at that? Warriors up to. 22 seconds left. I don't want to get too far off subject, but anyways, I personally think this could have went either way, but I want to know what you guys think. Let me know in the comments, and I'll get back at you guys later, all right? Peace.